Hello, beautiful Libras. Welcome back, everybody. Let's get right to your read. Libra, thank you so much for all your participation in the channel by liking and subscribing and commenting. I truly, truly appreciate it. That is how I pick up your energy. So let's see what's going on for Libra. First card out. Obstacles to overcome. What's going on here, Libra? Libra energy. There's a new, there's a sunrise here. It's only temporary situations. What's going on here? Dealings or a relationship with a man with dark complexion or hair. Feeling tied down or frustrated. Feeling something is lacking for their, from their life. They want to reconcile. <laughs> Somebody wants a reconciliation here. This is happiness and well-being. New opportunities, possibilities, and paths opening up. Unsettled times. Need to plan ahead. What's going on? An increase in material wealth or spiritual growth. Something, well, that's Libra energy. The, you could be this masculine. If you are the feminine, someone wants reconciliation. Peace and harmony. Someone's in need of help, assistance, or guidance. Hmm. They may have... This is love. Got advice from a friend or needing advice from a friend. Ooh. They're pissed off about their money. They may have lost their job. I don't know. It could be a family member who they're having a falling out with. I don't know. Friends and family fighting and arguing. Mm. It's looking like this person is fighting and arguing with their family. They could have lost their position. They could have lost their job over whatever advice that they got from somebody. Let's see. Libra. Just breathe. <laughs> Show the world the real you. They're not communicating. There's no communication. They're not talking. It's time for a healing. You and your loved ones are safe. They need to get out of their comfort zone. Mmm. They're having family issues, family trouble here. What's going on? Somebody is really angry. They could have lost their temper and they could have lost their job. Don't worry what could go wrong. If something does go wrong, you'll be able to make the best out of it. You're going to make mistakes and it's okay. Sometimes you learn by messing up. Lessons in life repeat until they're learned. Remember, you came here to teach others. Let go. There's something better on the horizon. What's going on? You're creating a you that you're going to be proud of. Your life's at a turning point right now. You're ready. You'll be surrounded by people with different agendas. It may scare you away, but fight it. You got this. You will have financial security in life. 
realize that you have all the qualities to be a leader. There is still time to change the road you're on. It's never too late. Maybe this person trusted their family members. Maybe this person got advice from their family and friends about you. It would seem as if now they're fighting and arguing. This person could have lost their job. They could have lost you over listening to this um, family. They're fighting and arguing and somebody is losing their cool. They could have lost their temper at work and gotten fired. Listening to the advice, somebody may have confronted somebody at work and lost their job over it. Let's see. Justice has appeared three times. Luck is on your side. Recognition, angelic help. Just trust. The people you spend the most time with shape who you are. So this person has got to learn to be independent. Think independently. They might be... They may have been codependent on what friends and families was telling them to do. And now they're pissed off. They've lost their temper. They could have lost their job. It may... Yeah, someone needs to grow up. It's something to do with this person trying to manifest. They were in denial. Uh -huh. They might be going to counseling. You've got a lot of financial growth by using your voice. Let's see what the angels want to tell this person I don't know somebody needs to grow up they're codependent on this person for money they are they need to grow the hell up they need to detox man I'm telling you they gotta be willing to change. They were resisting change. They were in denial. They've been spending money. They're going broke. Hmm. They're letting go. You've maybe, they're getting a higher perspective. Follow your heart. Hmm. There is something better. This person is being talked to. They're saying there's a better course of action. Working alone may not be the answer. Review the details. Like Archangel Michael is talking to this person, clearly showing him there are two paths. One is free of obstacles. One is free of illusion. One path is clearly lit and the other is dark. Why are you going down this dark road when you don't need to? Because of friends? Because of family? Don't you know that there's something better for you, Archangel Michael is saying? What's going on with this person? advice oh. 
this person started talking to somebody who they thought was giving them wise advice, but they were manipulating them. Now this could be work. This could be a supervisor. Someone talking to this person, manipulating them. This is work. Okay. Oh my God. So this person, they're in a crisis. They could have recently just lost their job. They were listening to someone. Someone was giving them advice. Or this is a supervisor manipulating this person into doing something. And now they are getting a tower on their finances and their home and their property. They shouldn't have trusted the, with this advice. They did not know which path to take. They want to come see there is a divine union. Okay? A king and a queen of wands. Who they had nothing but respect for and ghosted them based on what this advice family member maybe have given them. Confuse them. This advice. And now they're angry. L control your temper or you'll be sorry. That's what the tea leaf said. Control your temper or you'll be sorry. So this could have been an ex-wife or a wife energy. They're like pissed off at this wife or this ex-wife. Because they listen to some freaking advice about their soulmate. They could have lost their job, lost their home, lost their property, stressing the hell out, can't eat, can't sleep. Lying, <gasps> making up lies because they were jealous, making accusations that were untrue because they were jealous. This person was in denial. Causing a three of swords and stuck. They may have hurt you, their soulmate, thinking something, doing something that they regret. They regret listening. I don't know if this is a child or someone needs to grow the fuck up. Growing up is here. So they may have... Someone just doesn't want to grow up. I don't know.
what's going on? They're getting some kind of karma. They feel foolish. They got trapped by another lover. Oh my good God. Listening to the advice of some friend at work or some kind of... advice that they got from family or friends or co-workers telling them to ghost you or this earth angel they could have taken advice from a masculine with dark hair saying you know, grass is greener somewhere else type of thing. This person has lost their job, their employment. It seems like they're losing their homes, their vehicles, their property. Someone needs to grow the fuck up. Acting very immature. This other lover is very, very immature. Especially with money. Yeah, what's this? Daddy Warbucks? Their own child? might have been like swindling them or something like that you know not wanting to lose their financial cash cow it seems as if this person is dealing with an ex-wife or an ex-girlfriend who needs to grow the fuck up uh, they're shit disturbing, they're causing trouble, and I think they started trouble for this soulmate and for this person at work. They could have lost their temper and they could have got fired from their job. is like a slow death. <laughs> this person owes you a genuine apology. They're spying on you to see if you're single, if you're getting other offers, stuff like that. This is your past person who walked away or you walked away from. Oh, God. You're in a toxic marriage, some kind of divorce, and they're fighting and arguing. There's causing discord amongst family and friends. The fuck is this all about? People spreading rumors, gossip, and lies. Like I said, they could have listened to this dark, um, energy, dark hair, dark skin, dark complexion, and they could have gotten advice from this person. And this was a friend, right? Oh. Could have got them fired. Someone stealing their job. Set them up. They're stealing their job. Hmm. 
They didn't want this person having this opportunity with you of love. They were friends are gossiping and backstabbing this person. They were lying, deliberately setting this masculine up to lose their love, their job, their finances. Backstabbing two face friends. Very selfish, arrogant. This person is drinking heavily. They're self-medicating. This person trusted uh, their confidants. This other one is stealing their job. Deliberately trying to get them fired. Not only did they make up stories about the Empress, the High Priestess here, they're making up, so they're destroying, this one masculine is destroying single-handedly this masculine's life. They are. They're getting them fired from their job. They're getting them away from their High Priestess. It's deliberate. I don't know, maybe this masculine said too much to these people. Control your temper or you will be sorry. This person may have taken vengeance out on this other masculine, finding out that they were backstabbing them and betraying them, not only spreading rumors and gossip about them, but you, about you. This person is finding out that this person, who is the person who has been spreading all these rumors and gossip, I think there is a fight that broke out at work and they got fired. They wanted to set this masculine up so they could steal their job. They wanted to set this masculine up so that they could steal their love. They did not want this. They're jealous of this masculine. So break up their relationship. Let's work on that. Let's break. Let's bring in the ex-wife here. They're working with the ex-wife. This other masculine bringing in their ex to sabotage this union. So if we can get rid of the high priestess, because this, obviously this person had spiritual protection when you when the feminine was around the masculine. So we got to get rid of the feminine. Let's break them up. Let's introduce them to someone else right? Break up their relationship. And now I got this masculine right where I want him. Now they don't have the protection of the empress or the high priestess. This other masculine is deliberately stealing their job, stealing, breaking up their relationships. They call this a friend. I call that a false ass friend. They're getting fired. Set them up. They're sitting there celebrating that this masculine has lost their job. They're sitting there celebrating that this masculine lost their true love. It's a big setup to take this masculine down. This...
This is family and friends doing this. They lost their job. They've lost their income. They have lost their love. What are you fucking doing here? Saying that this mask on saying, oh, they physically attacked me on the job. No physical violence allowed on the job, but they provoked this mask on and provoked him and provoked him. They're talking to this, whoever this mask on is, this dark complected one is talking to this other masculine's exes getting them involved in destroying this relationship, destroying them on the job. This masculine is getting fired. They're drinking heavily. Could have said that this masculine was drinking on the job. Could have said that this masculine was being physically violent to them or physically aggressive to them or something. Oh, I've got proof. I've got a tape. Maybe they tape recorded a conversation. This masculine might have been threatening this other masculine to shut their effing mouth. tape recorded it and turned it into the supervisor. It was a setup. Finding out that this gossip and rumors about the Empress were untrue. This masculine could have gone on the attack of their ex and this other co-conspirator. They got him fired. All so that this masculine would be codependent on them, being away from their empress. Yeah, they want to reconcile. It's one masculine setting up another masculine using their ex to do it. Feeding them information to spread rumors and gossip around the job. What the hell? This person lost their temper. Got tired of these accusations that were made up, making up stories about this masculine to the feminine, spreading rumors and gossip about the feminine to get the masculine away from the feminine, and then that's not good enough. Not only did they co-conspire with this other lover to get rid of the feminine, now they're getting him fired off the job. It's one masculine working with the other masculine's ex to get them fired off the job, to get them away from the, the high priestess. They were just a little bit too gullible and a little too naive. Trusting these people. And now there is a big family frickin' fight and discord about it. Because somebody was gossiping. Somebody is spreading too much information. This person lost their cool. Lost their temper. They may have... said something, got aggressive, done something, somebody tape record them and got them fired off the job. But they're guilty of sin. They're sitting there smirking, celebrating that this masculine has been fired. 
Yeah. The people you surround yourself with shape who you are. That's who they were hanging out with. That's their good friends, their good family. Got him fired. Heard it through the grapevine. And the tail goes taller on down the line. They're losing everything. This person feels they got nothing left to lose. I've lost my true love. I've lost my effing job. I've lost everything I've worked for. What the hell do I have to lose? They may have gone on a rampage. And having a giggle about it. Having a laugh about it. How they screwed them over. Yeah, I don't know if I could handle that. <laughs> to be real, I'd confront them as well. I wouldn't hesitate. And I think this masculine confronted them. I think this masculine held their feet to the fire. And they were tape recorded. Turned it into the supervisor and got them fired off the job. They played right into it. Oh, they were trying to look cool, fit in with these people, trying to look popular, fit in with these people, you know, trying to be cool. And then these are the people that are going to stab you in the back and they've been stabbed in the back. Yep, they want to reconcile all right. Now that they've lost everything, and it's looking like most of the people who they thought were their friends, the people they thought were good family, it was just for their own greed. All these people needed to grow up, but it is this masculine who needed to grow up the most. And be trusting people like that. Bunch of backstabbers. Bunch of gossipers. Yeah. Like, when you're hanging out with people who are backstabbing and gossiping, be sure as hell they're going to do that to you. That's what this person did, was kissing these people's ass. Kiss their ass, sell you down the road to look popular, and now that it's happening to them. Now they're getting a dose of how it feels to do unto others if you would have them do unto you. And that's just as simple as it gets. It's all fine and dandy when the gossip's about someone else until they're doing it to you. You may have been with this mask on. You may have been the victim. You could be this masculine and your feminine did this to you. I don't know. But what comes around goes around. So if this person sold you down the road and was too busy gossiping about you and yours and they went along with it and contributed to it and participated in it, it is their karma. Because these are not friends and these are not family. I don't care if they're blood family or on blood family. They're shit disturbers and having a good laugh at this person losing everything that they cared about. It's funny to these people. It's one masculine taking another down. That's all it is. Destroy their life, destroy their true love talk about them they sided with these people so that's their karma they sided with them 
and now they want to come reconcile getting advice from a friend advice from a friend oh they're losing all their money they might have been um, put back or, or like lost their original position if they didn't get fired or whatever they might have put them on like temp work make it difficult for them to go to work or stay there working squeezing them out that's their good friends and it is work related rolled them for their position stole their job tape recording them turning in evidence this person could have figured them out could have confronted them and reported them oh they're a hothead oh they were drinking oh they they were this maybe they blood tested them and found alcohol in their blood I don't know. They were set up and they fell for it. Hmm. And they don't have to be dark skinned or dark haired either they could be but they it could just be that they were a dark energy hmm. oh come on fulfill a fantasy i'll hook you up with somebody ghosted a star friends come on come on end your relationship you know what I mean end your relationship just stop talking to them family confusing them Messing with her mind. Come on, there's something better else out there. Come on, there's something better for you. Ghost them, ghost them. Making accusations. Causes this person to push you away. Listening to these friends. Listening to these family members. Again, friends and family. Take care.